The aim of Stephen's story is to spread as much positivity as possible. He was surprised how quickly and how far his message spread with the help of social media. 13th of January 2013, I made a Facebook page called Stephen's Story. It was on that page that his mum made a final post. She wrote, My heart is bursting with pride, but breaking with pain for my courageous, selfless, inspirational son, who passed away peacefully in his sleep in the early hours of this morning. The ongoing support and outpouring of love for Stephen will help greatly at this difficult time, in the same way as it helped Stephen throughout his journey. We all know he will never be forgotten, his spirit will live on, in all that he achieved and shared with so many. The teenager knew he wouldn't recover from bowel cancer, but as he battled on, he set about raising thousands of pounds for charity, which turned into millions and attracted the attention of the Prime Minister. Well, he was really inspiring. I mean, I feel deeply sorry for Stephen's family, for everyone that who knew him. He was determined not to waste a minute, not to waste an hour or a day, and I can hardly think of anyone I've met with such a zest for life and such a belief that you can get things done and who wanted to live every minute. At his former school, Stephen saw this wall with messages of positivity, now also filling with memories and tributes. I think of what a, a fantastic human being he is. Um, he was, he was you know, funny, um, interested in other people, great listener as well as a good talker. Um, and terrifically modest and grounded. He's just the, the, the best person you'd want to know. Stephen came up with a bucket list, things he wanted to see, do and achieve with the time he had left. Skydiving, getting a tattoo, hugging an elephant, even crowd surfing in a rubber dinghy. But his greatest ambition was to raise as much money for the Teenage Cancer Trust as he could. With the help of Jason Manford and other celebrities, Stephen soon smashed his target. In a statement, the comedian said Stephen was a credit to humanity. He said the reason we took to him so passionately was because he was better than us. He did something that none of us could even imagine doing. Those who knew Stephen best said he wouldn't want anyone to feel sorry for him, but instead, just keep giving. Lisa Dowd, Sky News, Staffordshire.